What's going on, everybody? I uh, hope everybody is uh, doing pretty good. I uh, know it's been a while since my last video. Uh, still picking up stuff here and there. Just have been kind of in a funk lately with the uh, wife not working and everything else. Uh, she did start at the place that laid her off uh, last week. So she is back to work. So hopefully things will start getting uh, a little bit better on the up and up. But uh don't want to bore you too much with any of that stuff, but on to the pickups. Uh, quite a bit of stuff, actually. Uh, <laughs> uh, and this is not all of it. I've actually uh, kept some stuff to the side, and uh, we'll show that off in a later video. But a couple things not TD-related. Uh, these were freebies from an eBay seller, but... Pretty sweet if you ask me. Uh, 94, 95 SP Premier Prospects rookie of Grant Hill in the screw down. And then out of 2010 Gridiron Gear, Noshan Moreno Panini Prime, one color patch, uh, numbered 43 of 50. I'm probably not going to show up very well. But those were freebies nonetheless. Nonetheless. Wow, I can't talk. Uh, still talk to a few. Uh, a few guys here and there, uh, Michael, this film not yet rated, uh, Ryan, RBI crew, uh, try and call Chris every once in a while and catch up with him, but uh, I am still around, I promise, uh, even though you haven't seen videos, I'm still watching videos, I just, I don't comment much anymore because I'm not as creative as I used to be, so, but anyways, on to more pickups. Uh, these first few are going to be base and uh, inserts, but uh, 2014 SPX base, that was actually a freebie in a pickup from an eBay seller. Out of exquisite, numbered 45 of 70. I know a lot of, uh, I know Boston Broncos fans, not a big fan of the college stuff. Um, but when you're a player collector, Gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, 97 Skybox Impact. This is the Rave. Got the purple foil. Uh, been wanting one of these for a while. 28 to 150. Pretty sweet. Uh, on to some of the memorabilia stuff. Uh, 2012, 2012, 2013. 2013. Tops. This is the uh, Captain's Manufactured Patch. Number to 99, 11 of 99. Out of 2014 SPX, uh, Eddie George, Trell Davis, dual winning material jersey piece. And out of 2011 uh, Threads, this is the Heritage Collection patch. That's the S uh, on the Broncos across the, the chest plate. And that is numbered 10 of 25. Finally snagged one of these. Uh, took me a while. Finally, seller uh, actually opened up lines of communication, so I was finally able to get this for what I thought was a reasonable price. But uh, out of 06 National Treasures, this is the Game Worn Laundry Tag. Gorgeous card. Numbered 4 of 10. So, pretty sweet. And then the rest of these are going to be Automographs. Uh, hoping here in the next month or so, I'm going to hit the collection milestone, and I'll talk more about that uh, as it gets closer. But out of 95, this is signature rookies. This is the international parallel number, uh, hand number 486 of 2750. Hard signed on card. Uh, <laughs> Something that I hate about Panini stuff, the lower end crap, I think they put the crappy stickers on the cards. Uh, the better products, they put the better stickers as far as the autograph centering and staying on the sticker is concerned. But for whatever reason, the lower end products, they put the crappy autographs on it. But, you know, it is what it is, and sometimes you can't be patient. But out of 2011 Prime Signatures, uh, numbered 11 of 25. 
So I'm only missing three out of those, and two of them are printing plates, and the other one, of course, is the 101, but haven't seen them. Uh, 2004, Donruss Classics, Significant Signatures. I have the one to 75 and finally was able to get the one numbered to 25. Need to put that in the magnetic. Uh, out of Exquisite, uh, picked this one up for what I thought was kind of a steal considering what the other ones have sold for. This is the uh, Dimensions uh, on card numbered 2 of 25. So that's a pretty sweet card, but look at <laughs> That's what you call a magnetic. <clears throat> Tells you how long it's been since I made a last video. I'm trying to keep this fairly short, but uh, I picked this up with my eBay bucks last quarter out of uh, National Treasures. This is the gold parallel. So I now have all of those except for the one of one autograph. That's number ten of ten, and then. Out of 2011 Timeless Treasures, I'm only missing one of these as far as the autographs are concerned, <clears throat> and it's number to five, but this is the Championship Season uh, Patch Autograph, three-color patch auto. Numbered, two of ten. So, actually, I'm going to go and show one more. These other ones I'm going to go ahead and save, but... Uh, I sent this, uh, sent a picture of this to uh, this film not yet rated, and it's from a product that isn't busted a whole lot. And I was wondering if they actually truly made this card because I had not seen it. But this is the first and only one that I've seen, and I'm pretty pumped to actually get it. Uh, this is out of 2013 Momentum. Barely picking up number three of five, but it's a dual autograph of Warren Sapp and Terrell Davis, Class Reunion 95. That is a sweet, sweet, sweet card. And like I said, it's one of those in which I didn't really know if they were ever going to make it. And when it finally popped up on eBay on auction, I told myself it didn't matter what it took. I was going to own that card, so... It is in the collection, uh, secured. A uh, few other minor things that are still here, but I'm going to wait uh, to show those off in a later video. I do have a couple things coming in uh, for all you insert uh, guys out there. Uh, won't call them extremely rare, but rare enough. Uh, so pretty pumped to actually get those uh, for what I thought was fairly good prices. Uh, almost paid full book for a couple, but it is what it is. And when you're a player collector uh, and you have people putting things out there for astronomical values, sometimes you just got to snag them when they're cheaper than what other people want. So anyways, that's all I have. Uh, hope everybody is doing well. Uh, I am still around. I promise, uh, just not as uh, much of a capacity as I'd like. Uh, I do still have stuff sitting here to send out for people, and if I'd get off my lazy ass, I might actually get some packages out in the mail. So I uh, hope to be doing that in the next couple days, uh, if not this weekend. Uh, work's been really kicking my tail, uh, continuously getting piled with more stuff. But I like it. <laughs> makes the day go by faster. But anyways, thanks, everybody, for watching. Uh, be on the lookout for the uh, collection announcement um, in regards to as far as the milestone is concerned because it is getting really, really close. And I never uh, in a million years thought I would ever reach that point. But uh, it's getting close. Now I've just got to be picky. But anyways, thanks everybody for watching. Uh, have a good rest of the week. Tomorrow's Friday. And uh, everybody have a good weekend. Uh, see you guys later. Peace. I'm out!